What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Rocket, and today we'll be going over Mirage Smokes on CSGO. So our Mirage Smokes consist of the a site Smokes, the Mid-Control Smokes, and b site Smokes, as well as the CT Smokes. So without further ado, let's get started and go over with a site Smokes. So we're going to start off with our a site Smokes. We're going to go start off with the CT Smoke and um, a site You want to lie yourself up at this door. Really aim at the, um, this little dot in here of the top three dots and you want to turn around aim right at that corner do a nice jump throw and should smoke off CT um, you can there's you can do a lot better smoke than that however um, that's usually how you smoke off CT so let me do it again I can do it a lot better just for review line yourself up with this door around aim that corner and jump through. there that's a lot better smoke it's really best to have that smoke off the entire area including this little box that's right here and be careful of people just jumping on top of them these on um, ticket booth but I highly doubt they jump on top of ticket booth they usually be around and T and triple default and under palace. And our next smoke is going to be our stair smoke. This is really going to be helpful, for, especially if someone's in um, apps and they want to, like, you know, peek in the site and stuff. And so, what you want to do is jump on this little platform here. You want to aim right, you want to aim right here. Well, line yourself up with this little rectangular thing on the wall. And you want to aim right out in the open. I'm throwing smoke. And just do a th simple throw. It's gonna bounce on the tick. It's gonna bounce off the Tetris, and it's gonna like land right there. It's a really helpful smoke. And there's times in um in matches where they peek out of um stairs and they and they op somebody here, so around here. So this is one you want to be careful of, and also be careful like right around there if they peek out of jungle. Speaking of jungle, I want to teach you the jungle smoke. So you want to hop and hop and hop over here. You're going to notice there's four blocks here, right? One, two, three, four. You want to go to the second one right here. You want to send yourself up with this um, second block and turn around and aim direct. Try your best to aim directly at that corner. If not, it's not going to bounce off of um, stairs in order to do the smoke. And that's how, the only way the smoke will work. There you go. It bounced off the stairs, bounced off the wall, and you have a nice smoke into. Um, jungle now with that smoke the stair smoke and the ct smoke it's going to help you um entry in a a lot a lot better so you usually you just peek your angles and then always like check this first and then if you get killed from a um, sandwich um you got your support that's where your support player comes in and just take them out and then you just work your way in and then plant bomb but those are a site smokes let's move on to mid site so for mid, what we usually do is, first things first, we usually just um, smoke off this um, cat smoke here. That way we can get across safely. And then we're right behind these boxes. Some people like to go all the way out and then peek into this nest. So what I usually do is just, um, I go right here for the first thing I usually do. And I like look at this um, flap here. And what I do is, um, line myself up with this corner that corner and then I just do a simple throw this is a really good smoke but be careful because you may accidentally have a actually never mind that's actually a good smoke now usually there'll be a, like a gap here if you did it incorrectly but that's the most optimal way of um, smoking off um, CT I mean well not CT excuse me nest so here I am. Oh, that oh smoke disappeared, but it should cover everything in them nests pretty good. As long as you uh, and you and you, sh and you should be able to do it well. As you now the next two smokes are just like basically a choice smoke. Like I want to say is a it's like a choice of between if you're going short or if you're going connector. But if you're gonna go connector, um, you want to smoke off short. So what I do is aim at that antenna over there, and I just do a simple throw. Now, as I do like some terrible B hops over there, um, 
you can see that some um, short is smoked off. You can go in a um, connector, take everyone out. This is good if you're doing an A split at least. And for mid smoke, this one's a hard one. I'm not gonna lie. I took a lot of practice into this. And usually, if you see the grenade, you want to line like the top edge of the the top right of the grenade with this second line, and I'll also cover the um, pin with um, that little dot right there. So it should look like this, but it's a real hard smoke to do. I may not get it the first time. If I don't, that's my fault. But you guys will get the point. Yeah, so that's what usually a smoke will look like. Uh, if you, you, You'll you done it right if you don't really have this small gap over here. Actually, that is good enough. Yeah, that is that is pretty good. Um, usually, like, people wouldn't, don't really want away from this, but it's a really good smoke to know. And that's, like, the best way of um, smoking off connector. That way, you need to, like, um, before, like, anyone goes in a cat, you can check here. You can... And also, like, your um, underpass guy can check around here. Take those guys out. And I'm going to do this again, just because it's a really hard smoke. I like to use the pin. Some people will aim, like, at this, um... Some people will aim right at this um, plant and then this part here. Usually what I find more easier is using the grenade, the grenade to your advantage. So that lines up like that and you do a simple throw. And that's how you smoke off a um, connector. And like I said, be wary, be careful. If you don't, you done it right. If everything smoked off, but this is what happens when you don't do it right. You can get a little. It gets them a little one way, and yeah, but that explains it all. But guys, um, that's really like um mostly a. Um, do the first for connector. Just do the um first smoke that I showed, and um, let's go over to um B site. Now the smokes for B site are like the most easiest smokes I usually like to do when it comes to Mirage. So the first smoke I usually do is um catwalk smoke. And this is like best if um you're like have like eco rounds, you don't want to get killed from cat. However, oh rumbo. But anyways, what you want to do is line yourself up with this pillar here. Um, aim at that corner. But don't aim too much at the corner, or else it's gonna like bump up the next to the wall. So what you want to do is like aim right there and do a simple throw. That's gonna bounce off into catwalk and as I run all the way over here it's a good enough smoke and as I no clip all the way over here um, usually there'll be like an offer here and stuff like that and they'll like try your they're trying their best to like um, pick you and everything but it can be hard at some point now if you got a good real good offer then yeah he'll pick you like around here but usually this most of this place will be smoked off and if you like put that in conjunction with a flash you should be fine and our next smoke is going to be um, our bench smoke. That way, you won't really get killed from bench as soon as you enter. Um, you want like the same corner. Also, keep in mind, don't hit the wall. Want to aim right there. Do a nice throw. And since that long and that long shot smoke will smoke off bench, pretty good. That's basically like one of the two smokes that I usually like. And then that last smoke I'm going to show you on B site. Is that is for window, and usually that's in case of offers and someone like peeking you window. And usually, what you want to do, go under this lamp, and want to aim eh, right there, I guess, right in the, out in the open. And you're like pretty good, and then you're pretty good to go. Wait for that smoke to pop. Then what? That way, with the bench smoke and cat smoke and that smoke right there. Be able to like um take sight a lot more easier, especially when you have your entry factor pre-firing, and also like keep in mind if someone is right here, right there, or if you're like pushing in late, someone could be right there. You never really know, but I but it's really rare at the at this it's really it's really rare at B site when someone push all the way up here. I did it a couple times, people passed me, but now like at higher ranks, they're gonna know you're there and they can take you out very easily, especially when they hear you like jump up. All the way up here and a good entry fragger early like check this area too so you may want to be careful 
But that's for B site. Um, let's go over the T site smokes, and there's not many smokes for T site. But let's go over them anyway because they're really important for delaying the rushes on T side. All right, for CT side, there's like um two smokes you want to learn on A site. Um, one easy smoke is just aim right there, and then just like bounce off the wall, and you smoke off A main, and then also you want to bounce off the wall here to smoke off um all of um um palace. Then for mid, there's really not much you can do with mid. Usually in mid, people be ballsy and just, you know, aim out here. And, you know, just be able to take them out that way. Usually your goal in mid, who has a CT, make sure they don't push out, like, all the way out here. If you can do that, then you should be able to be well with mid. And usually, um, if you count, if you say there's a, there is one mid or a few mid, some people will be in con connector and short, and then they'll probably be able to help you out. But be wary of on mid. As I break vents, we're gonna go into B site. And usually the only smoke I have to worry about on CT side is this smoke right here. Usually I recommend somebody, um, whoever's going cat to smoke this for you. That way it gives them more it gives a life you can be here a lot faster and then you don't have to worry about um, people coming over here. You can just like spray them down as they come through the smoke if they rush through. You don't have to worry about a thing, but that's all the like smokes I need to show you. Um, let me know what you guys think. If I miss out any important smokes for your Mirage, please let me know in the comments below. But I hope you guys liked the video and check. Please sure to check out my other smoke tutorial video on Dust Two. And thank you so much. I'll see you guys later.